Good morning and welcome to this historic event. I'm absolutely thrilled that all of you could join us. Dear friends, representatives from three levels of government, our community leaders, colleagues, and the media. Today, we're here together to celebrate Sick Kids' commitment to research and to children's health as we open the Peter Gilgan Center for Research and Learning. This building and the activities that will take place within these walls symbolizes our promise to continue a strong legacy of science, of discovery, of innovation, and of learning. We have been on a long, long, long and exciting journey, developing the vision for and the plans to create this beautiful, complex building. There are so many people who have been along this journey, and the list is as long as the tower is high. We got going by establishing a very ambitious campaign goal of $200 million, the largest amount ever to be raised privately for a Sick Kids Capital project. And today I'm thrilled to be able to report that we have exceeded our goal, $201 million in change. So how did we do it? There are many to acknowledge and thank today, and I'm going to list every single one of the 13,000 people. You think I'm kidding. Look how many pages I have. We make these investments, ladies and gentlemen, because we know that scientific curiosity leads to the kinds of discoveries that will heal our children, cure them, or simply make their lives fuller and more vibrant. This new center will allow doctors and scientists to do just that, work together in a research neighborhood to find new treatments for health problems such as brain disorders, organ diseases, and cancer today and well into the future. This building was built and was made to encourage collaboration, which is so important when it comes to science and research. Because as good as we are individually, we accomplish so much more when we bring our best ideas together. To achieve this innovation, our team believed ferociously in this hospital's vision of excellence. We believed in the urgency of your work in finding better outcomes for children's health. We believed in designing a facility without equal in the world. We were inspired by your vision. We were motivated to work collaboratively with your community. It's been the honor of my life to be part of this project. Thank you. To commemorate all the work and the thought that went into this project, we produced a video. In that video, one of our patient's moms talks about her son, Hunter, and how during the course of his treatment at SickKids, he has watched our building grow. She says in the video that Hunter wants in. He wants a personal tour. He wants answers. This is his building. Hunter, your time has finally come. Come on up and join me as we cut the ribbon. I was thinking that you might describe this building as a new form of wealth on Bay Street. It's the wealth of the scientists, the knowledge, the developments that are going to occur, the discoveries and innovations that we're going to see here in the future. And it's going to last not only for our city here, but for our country at least and for all of North America. The benefits are going to last for decades to come. The scientific potential impact of this center is boundless. If you mix clever, collaborative, driven people together in interactive environments, you're going to promote the creative ferment that sparks the grand discovery, the eureka moment. The Peter Gilgan Center is going to ensure that sick kids leads the way in making those kind of discoveries, translating them into real impact for children in Ontario and around the world. Today's research is going to make a difference in children's lives tomorrow. What an exciting day this has been. Earlier today, we cut the ribbon to officially open this beacon of hope for the future of children's health. So tonight, we bring together our community of inspiring supporters. For really and truly, it is you who have truly made all of this possible. 
Without your philanthropic support and commitment to our mission, we would not be standing here today. So on behalf of every one of us at SickKids, thank you from the bottom of our hearts.